Hi friends! My name is Shannon and I work for Cobb County Public Library and I have a really great story to share with you today. It's called Old Bear by Kevin Henkes. Let's read it together. Old Bear By the time Old Bear fell asleep for the winter, it was snowing hard. Can you see him in his cave? Sleep it. Soon, he was dreaming. Do you dream when you sleep sometimes? Mm -hmm, I do too. He dreamed that spring had come and he was a cub again. The flowers were as big as trees. He took a nap in a giant pink crocus. Do you see Old Bear sleeping in a flower? There he is. Then he dreamed that it was summer. The sun was a daisy and the leaves were butterflies. Part of the sky clouded over, and it rained blueberries. What? What would you do if it was raining blueberries? Would you be like Old Bear and eat them right out of the sky? Yeah, I think I might too. That'd be so yummy. <gasps> Next, he dreamed of autumn. Everything was yellow and orange and brown. Even the birds, and the fish, and the water. Look at that. That is so beautiful. Wow. After that, he dreamed that winter was back. The world was covered in ice. It was night, and the sky was blazing with the stars of all colors. The cold went on forever. Look at all that snow and ice. We don't really get a lot of snow and ice like that here in Georgia, but wherever Old Bear lives, he does. Lots of snow. Old Bear slept and dreamed, dreamed and slept. When he finally woke up, it seemed to him that no time had passed since he had fallen asleep. He yawned, he stretched. He poked his head out of his den to see if it was still snowing. He blinked and blinked again. What do you think it looks like outside of his den? Do you think it's still snowy? Mm -hmm. And when Old Bear walked out into the beautiful spring day, it took him a minute to realize that he wasn't dreaming. Look at that. How beautiful. The end. Thank you so much for sharing that story with me today. I hope you like it, and if you did like it, Kevin Henke's has lots and lots of books you can choose from at the library. So you can look him up, you can ask your librarian to find more books by him. You can check out Old Bear or one of his other books too. So I hope you'll find some more books to read and share with the people you love, and I hope that I'll see you again next time for more stories. Bye!